Welcome back to the Maelstrom, ladies and gentlemen. Today we are going to be looking at another unboxing. Uh, we're looking at the 100 Kingdoms Order of the Crimson Tower. Uh, 100 Kingdoms players have been clamoring to start getting their order troops, so this is definitely an exciting kit to look at. Um, we're a little bit late showcasing it on the channel. We did have it in with some pre-orders that just came out, uh, so that was the reason for the delay. Uh, but we do want to go ahead and showcase them because this is a very exciting kit and a big uh, addition to the 100 Kingdoms uh, tools for their uh, army. Uh, so you get three models in the box. Uh, these are going to be your heavy cavalry from the Crimson Tower. These guys are brutal on the battlefield. Um, I cannot wait to see them in action. Um, we're going to go ahead and crack this box open though and see what we've got inside. All right, so we have our bases, our sprues, which we'll take a look at in just a moment. All right, then we have our instruction sheet, which is standard now, obviously. We've gotten very used to seeing these. Then we have our usual uh, QR code and uh, living world info card. And then we have our Crimson Tower activation card. Very nice artwork on that one. All right, on to the sprues and the models themselves. So this sprue looks like we're mostly looking at the riders. Very cool shields, lots of battle damage. And I really like the helms there, especially. Next up, we have uh, our command sprue. It's gonna have your uh, mace for your leader. And then the banner, which I love already. Tons of cool detail going on there. Very nice. And then final sprue. We have our riders, or our horses rather. Um, so standard, like we've seen with the cataphract toy before, uh, two halves there glued together. Uh, they seem very much improved from the household knots, uh, which any of you have put them together. They are a little bit more of a struggle to get all the pieces in the right place, uh, but they were a very early kit, so this is not unusual. We've seen a lot of these improvements as uh, Parabellum has continued to grow and uh, get more knowledge on their uh, sprue uh, creation process. So we're gonna put these together and then we'll be back to take a look at them once they're complete. And the Crimson Tower are complete. These guys were super fun to build. Uh, my favorite detail of this kit is actually the banner uh, with what I assume is a noble lord who pushed the order too far, uh, impaled on a sword uh, to mount the banner top there. Um, I also love the fact that there's a lot of different options for the helmets uh, and the armor is somewhat personalized. It really makes them feel like a uh, order of knights. Um, and then the uh, heavily armored horses as well are a really cool part of the kit. Um, you also have for the leader uh, the option for the flail here. Um, it's uh, got a really cool command helmet as well for him. And then one guy here with the uh, shattered sword symbol on his shield. And then the lance that they are going to be so, so feared for. Uh, so that is uh, the Order of the Crimson Tower. Um, oh, and one other thing, these are mounted to uh, non-conquest bases at the moment, so don't use that as a scale reference. Uh, these bases are like 60 millimeters, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, they're close, uh, but I've got them mounted on there with hot glue so that I can do some static grass on their bases uh, before I glue them down. Uh, so if you're looking to pick up some Crimson Tower of your own, or if you're looking to expand a faction or start a brand new faction like the City States, which have just dropped for pre-order, uh, whenever you get to checkout in Parabellum's eShop, make sure that you click on the question that says, do you have a discount voucher? A box will populate and you can type Maelstrom 10 there to secure 10% off your order. You'll also send an affiliate fee our way. 
uh, help us out and help us to continue to show the game to the world. Um, we have battle reports planned in the very near future, uh, which are going to be starting soon, hopefully within just a couple more weeks. Um, and to all of you who have been supporting the channel and asking about where our content has gone, uh, we've been unfortunately spotty on communication. Uh, job schedules have changed. Uh, we, I've been working on a master's degree, so it has been hectic to say the least, but we are just a few weeks away, hopefully, from getting some battle reports to you again. Um, so make sure that you continue to check back regularly. We have a Patreon below in the description. If you want to follow that link, it will uh, show you what we've got over there. And you can decide if that's something you want to support or not. Um, you can also like and subscribe this video uh, to this channel and like this video. Uh, that will be another way that you can assist us in sharing this game with the world. As always, thank you for spending time with us today at the Maelstrom.